Hi guys, it's Catherine and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today in this video I decided to do the two week shred and this is how it went. God, I really do look like an egg right now. Okay, so I was just on Teams, I'm now on my lunch break. I really don't like how I look right now, <laughs> I'm recording on my phone. I was on Teams, um, obviously doing my college work and apparently we've got two weeks before we go back so that can only mean one thing that i've got two weeks to do the chloe ting two weeks shred i have tried to do this before gave up on the first video <laughs> so we'll see how long this lasts hopefully i'll be able to complete it or at least try and get through it because i need to see some results and if i can do it in two weeks that would be perfectly fine with me i just want to feel a bit more like myself before i go back to college because <laughs> i've just been eating and eating and it's actually terrible but i feel like a lot of us feel like this as well that we've just been eating out of boredom and i've been trying to work out trying to keep active but it's just motivation's not there so i'm going to try and do this two week shred and see how it goes. Um, so this is me on the first day. I'm doing it on the Monday, starting on a Monday. We're gonna see how it goes. So I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. I don't know if I'm gonna film me actually doing the workouts or not, but like this is my before the workout and I'm gonna do the first day now or try. I don't know if I'm gonna need like breaks in between the videos and like split up throughout the day, but we'll find out, I guess. So this is me before my first workout, my first day of doing the workout. <laughs> day two and there's three videos that i can do today but one of them is optional so i'm gonna go downstairs into the gym i'm gonna do the first two which were the same as yesterday which was the do this every day to lose fat or something i'll put them on the screen in the get abs in two weeks so i'll do those two videos hopefully and then i'll see what i'm like and then decide if i'm gonna do the optional video so yeah i'm gonna go down into the gym now i'm not gonna record it again it's very annoying that, I don't know, I don't want to film in the gym because I don't want to like show off the gym before I give the whole gym renovation videos out. There might be like a little area that I can do without giving too much, too much of a sneak peek off to you. Hopefully I'll try to remember to give you an update afterwards because yesterday I forgot to do it, but yesterday was fine. I just did the two videos and I'm not really adding my diet to this i'm just gonna see how i can go just by doing the workouts i'm trying to try and pick healthier options but it's not always like that and i'm i normally crave something sweet at night which is a bad habit that i've gotten to recently trying to keep my diet the same but there might be some alternatives like healthier of uh, a healthier alternative instead of like what I would normally crave or want to eat. Still recording on my phone, I'm sorry. My camera is over there, but I just need to delete some footage off the memory card, which I could do, but I'm just a bit lazy <laughs> and it's just easier to do this. But I have drunk a whole bottle of lemon water, well, water with a slice of lemon in, because I've heard that apparently that's good to like flush the toxins out of your body or something like that. I've done the two workouts that like you have to do. I haven't done the optional one yet because I am gonna go on a walk with a friend. I think we're probably gonna do quite a long walk. Did I even talk about the workouts? I don't think I did. The workouts were perfectly fine though. Well, not perfectly fine. I did have to have like a little bit of a rest when I was just a bit too tired to, well not tired, but like exhausted, but I did manage to do like everything. So yeah, I managed to complete them with a few little breaks instead of actually doing the exercises, but overall it was, you know, good. So today is day four. <laughs> I've got a headache right now, so it's not very fun and I'm not taking any paracetamol just yet. Um, if it gets any worse, I probably will have to. But today we've got three videos. I don't feel unmotivated today. It's just, I just feel kind of dead. <laughs> I'm just hanging, you know? How could, how could I describe how I feel? I just feel drained, but I think it's because I've got a headache. Like, I just feel tired, but I've had sleep, like I've slept. This is me before, and I never do the afters. I just always forget, which is quite silly of me, but I'm sorry. I don't even know what I'm saying. I don't even know if I'm speaking English right now. Oh, this really hurt. My head. Oh, I think I should 
should go take some photos as well. That hurts my head. taking some parachute small because then hopefully it won't hurt as much when I'm jumping around so fun oh got it out in one sometimes I overthink it too much and I'm like I'll swallow in three two one and then I can just never swallow it but do it straight away then without even thinking about it but yeah see you back in the gym so i managed to do two sets of the first video and there's three sets in total so i haven't completed any videos but hopefully i'm going to do it a bit later i had to stop because i didn't allow enough time to go in the gym and get all three workouts done and obviously i didn't think i was going to have a headache but i also had to make my lunch before i go back into lesson um, I've got five minutes until I start lesson again. So I thought oh, I'll just do the workouts later hopefully and hopefully I'll be feeling a bit more alive Later as well. So hopefully like maybe that will you know It might be better if I do it later or something thought I would update you that I haven't completed the workouts Yet, but hopefully later I will but I'm gonna enjoy my poached eggs on toast and try and survive three hours of childcare <laughs> online lessons <laughs> Back to um, the first quarantine when me and Grace used to do FaceTime workouts every night. from this sweaty mess for today tomorrow is a rest day might see you tomorrow if not i'll see you on day six today is day six i didn't update you at all yesterday because i was doing my work experience all day so i was at placement and also mother nature gave me a lovely surprise so i have been in bed all day except from going to waitrose to get the food shop but I am gonna give it this a go, even though I would never, like, I honestly never do exercise on my period. I stay in bed, which is probably really bad. So, if I actually manage to semi-complete this, I'm gonna be very proud of myself. But I feel like if I don't even, like, if I don't attempt it, then I've just failed. So, that's why we're gonna get attempt it and see how it goes. We've got this one, this one that we've done every day, and this is a new one that I haven't tried yet.
I think that was okay. I thought it was going to be a lot worse, not going to lie. But, like, there was, like, the odd time, the odd bit where I did, like, do slightly easier. For example, the up and down plank. I did that on my knees instead of my feet. Okay, we are on the third video now. We're just about to start. <laughs> I think I'm just overthinking it, but I feel a bit sick. Oh, I want to give up so badly, but I really want to finish it, so let's keep going. camera's literally about to die so that was perfect timing but yeah i'll see you tomorrow for another day okay it's currently seven o'clock and i'm here to do day seven these are the videos that we've got we've got the do it every day abs in two weeks core and arms and get that 11 line abs in 35 days okay i've just finished the workouts for today i mean it was okay but the last two videos, I would say I didn't give it my all. I was just like lacking motivation and I was just thinking about other things. I just like getting distracted. Not like physically distracted, just like mentally distracted. I don't really know how else to explain it. But then like I just took my time when going into the next, the next exercise. That's what I was supposed to say. Um, and I'm glad it's over <laughs> for today. <laughs> but I'll see you guys tomorrow for day eight. Okay, so today I've got three videos and one optional video. It is day eight today. These are the videos that we've got. So I've done these three before and I'm not quite sure if I am going to do that one. Kind of losing motivation, but we are going to try and push through. So I'm going to attempt to do these three videos and then maybe I'll update you after them. Um, tell you if I made it through or not. <laughs> but otherwise, tomorrow is a rest day, so can't wait for that. So it is currently day 10 and it's five minutes to nine right now and all i want to do is have a fat bowl of pasta and watch some youtube get into bed you know like i've really been debating since i've got home whether or not i do the workout or not and then i just do something else instead which is terrible because i probably should get it over and done with but at the same time i'm just so tired like today it's just made me so tired what i'm thinking is this re oh, this is a bad idea and I just know it. I don't know, like I, I should do the workout today, but at the same time I'm thinking I've got two workouts. There's four videos that I have to do today and there's two that I do tomorrow. So I'm thinking, do I just do six videos tomorrow? I think, I think, sorry to disappoint anyone, but I think what I'm going to do is not do the workout tonight and tomorrow. No, now I just feel guilty if I don't do the workout. It's terrible. I'm gonna attempt to do the workout. <laughs> okay, well, I'm gonna I'm gonna attempt. Oh, I hate this. I'm gonna attempt because otherwise I just feel guilty. So I'll give you an update like afterwards, and I'll actually try and remember to do it. <laughs> right. So update on the workout. 
I've managed to do the first three workouts. I've just got the arms and core one left, I'm pretty sure it is. Well, I guess it's this time again, so we are on currently day 11. So we've got do this every day, abs in two weeks, and I also just need to do this one from yesterday that I didn't manage to do. So I ran out of time. Can you tell I've just literally finished my workout? It is day 13 today. Just finished day 13. How amazing is that? I can't believe I've actually like, you know, not given. Okay, as I was saying before, I no storage popped up. I'm surprised that I haven't like, you know, given up and I fully, well, I feel like there has been times that I've wanted to give up, but I pushed through it. And like, maybe I did not give my all in some places, but I still, you know, got the workout done. So tomorrow is the last day. Also, I did do yesterday, which was that, Dave, day 12, I did do it. I did miss the last video, which is the 11, 11 line abs or something like that. I was going to do it today, but I've just done that one. So I would have done two of the same video, but you, you're going to hate me for this, but I'm going to miss it. I'm going to miss it. That's just one video that I've missed so far. <laughs> we'll see. We'll find out what happens tomorrow, hey? I also went for like a three-hour walk this morning with my family. Well, it wasn't a walk. It was a hike. Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow for the last day. Guys, it's day 14. It means it's the last day of the Chloe Tig two-week trad. I thought this day would never come. Also, I just stuck my toe on my bed. Um, So, we've got, we've got the Gymshark set on. Let's go downstairs. Hair is up, time to work out. Except one video, but we'll, we'll give that in this. It's okay. We're at like that nothing happened. Okay, let's talk results. So I only recorded three measurements for this challenge, which were my hips, my waist, and my weight. Now, I don't really know what kind of results I was hoping to get. I was just hoping to feel a bit better in myself. And if I did see any physical change in my looks, then that would be a bonus. So looking at my measurements, in my hips and my waist, I lost one inch in two weeks. And the results with my weight were basically the same. I stayed the same weight in kilograms, but the only change was there was a slight... Is it point of a mark, point of a decimal? So the main number stayed the same, but after the point, that changed on the day. So it did go up, but it didn't go up by one kilogram. It only went up by like, I don't even know, 0 0.5 or something like that. And I can't remember what time of the day I did weigh myself so it could be something to do with the time of day that I weighed myself but there's literally next to nothing of the weight change so I'm not gonna say that it's because of this because it could be anything and it's as I've said it's next to nothing so there's probably no difference so overall I do think this challenge was a good challenge because it did make me feel mentally better physically there wasn't much of a change obviously my results weren't amazing but I do think that was because I didn't put 100% into this challenge there was that one video I missed so that probably wouldn't have changed a lot or anything at all 
but I do think if I changed my diet and I put 100% into the videos when I was doing my workouts, there could have been more of a change. But I'm happy with how it went because it made me feel a bit more like myself. Because of lockdown, I wasn't being as active as I normally am. So just being that active for the two weeks just made me feel better within myself, which is good results for me. So that is the end of this video. I really do hope you enjoyed it. That is how the two week shred went for me. Maybe if you were to try it, it would go slightly different. Well, it would be different because we're two different people. So, if you want to try it, have a go. I think it's a good challenge to do. If you would like to subscribe, please click here. If you'd like to see another one of my videos, please click there. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next Sunday at 6pm. Bye!